When you're filling nail holes in a piece of stained wood, sometimes the filler can stand out like a black eye. So here's a quick tip for disguising those holes so that you end up with much better results. Now the first thing you need to remember is go ahead and stain your wood and apply at least one coat of clear finish over the top. It's much easier that way to match the color of your putty to the final color of the wood. Secondly, you want to make sure you get an oil-based putty that most trim carpenters use. Now you can buy this at your local hardware store or home center for about $2.50 a jar. Now there's really two advantages to using this filler. One, it comes in a wide variety of colors, so it makes it much easier to mix and match the tones together. And two, there's no sanding involved. Just simply put the putty in the holes and then wipe away the excess. Now something else you need to remember is that one color does not fit all. When you have oak or pine, you have two different colors going on. You have these dark grainy areas and these lighter areas, so you're going to need at least two different colors of putty. Now finally, you want to put one more coat of clear finish over your wood. This will help hold the putty in there because it is still soft under the surface.